Good morning, Dr. Eric Klijinski here, Fanwood Back Relief Center. Today we're gonna to talk about painful swollen knees. A knee can become swollen or painful for a variety of reasons. Um, it could be overuse, uh, it could be a sprain strain injury of some of the soft tissues surrounding the knee, um, it could be a tear um, of the meniscus, which is in, the, in both sides of your knee that um, is there for cushioning. Um, it could be uh, a Baker cyst, which is an inflammation on the back of the knee where you get swelling. Uh, if you're doing a lot of uh, squatting or stooping. Um, it could be arthritis, osteoarthritis, destruction of the cartilage, um, deterioration of the bone, uh, where those bones and cartilage gets worn away and they start to rub together and creates a lot of friction, pain, and swelling. Um, whatever the case uh, arises from, it's important that you take you know, immediate action, which means you know, first start with ice. Um, I like to start with ice for the first 24 to 48 hours. Um, 15 on, uh, 15 to 20 minutes on, and then about you know 45 minutes off, and then do it again. So almost every hour, uh, as much as you can, what's feasible if you're at work at home. Um, and then after that 48 hour period, I like to alternate ice and heat. So we put ice on for 15 to 20 minutes, then we switch to heat. Uh, and the theory behind that is the ice is going to drive any inflammation down, any swelling, and then the heat's going to bring blood to the area, which is going to bring a lot of nourishment uh, and healing properties to the knee. So that's what we like to do. Um, of course, use common sense. Any activities, um, motions um, that cause pain, listen to your body first and foremost. Try to avoid those positions, those movements, uh, just until it starts to you know, feel better. Um, also, some gentle stretching of the, the quadriceps, which is the front part of the leg, the hamstring, which is the back part of the leg, and the calves is going to be very important to keeping all those tissues nice and flexible, which is going to help to take some of that, again, swelling out um, of that area. Um, if the pain persists, obviously seek professional help. In our office, we treat knee pain and swelling a variety of ways. We do alternate the ice and the heat. We also have different therapy machines that we can use, like uh, TENS units, uh, electrical stimulation, uh, class four uh, deep tissue laser, which is gonna help to bring uh, blood and nutrient into the area, promote more healing uh, on the cellular level. Um, and then we also do uh, manual therapy, stretching, mobilization, and manipulation if needed. Um, if there is an injury that arose, then obviously you wanna get an x-ray. Uh, we'll send you right out for that x-ray, uh, get you set up, make sure there's no uh, fracture, nothing majorly dislocated or damaged. Um, and then we start with some rehab exercises and stretches in the office, combined with the mobilization, the manipulation of the knee, combined with the therapies. Uh, and if things are not heading in the right direction, then we move on to the next step, which is an MRI, uh, to see the, you know, the smaller details, the soft tissues of the knee, to see if there's any tears, um, any, anything that the x-ray did not pick up, more, more detailed uh, look of the knee. Uh, but whatever the case may be, um, if you have a question about why your knee is, is aching you, why it's swelling up, just give us a call, shoot us a message. Uh, a lot of stuff can be done at home, but if it's not, if it's something more complicated than that and you need to come in, we can advise you and get you treated or send you to the right uh, practitioner if necessary, whether that's an orthopedic doctor, a physical therapist, uh, whatever the case may be. Uh, so that's all we have today on pain, knee pain and swelling. If you have any questions, feel free to give us a call. We are here and always happy to help and answer your questions. Uh, if you like these videos, please like, uh, comment on them, share them. Uh, we greatly appreciate your support. Have an awesome day. Looks like we're going to have another good day uh, weather-wise. So get out and enjoy it. Talk to you soon. Bye.